Hello everybody, this is Nilnar. This is the first day of October. Today we're going to be playing the casting of Frank Stone. The commentation uh, story within the uh, realm of Dead by Daylight. And I thought we'd play it together and see how well we can enjoy the horror that it is. Um, we'll see how it goes. But let's uh, let's jump into this and check it out. I want to do a new game because I haven't played one yet, so. We'll do a new save and let's get into this. So we got Observer. Win a survey, but survival is expected. Survivor may or may not survive and sacrifice. Uh, you're not going to survive. But we'll do the standard survivor. We, we won't do uh, anything too. Uh, Crazy on this one. Every choice made, every action taken, has its consequence. Some will save lives. Some will result in death. I've sacrificed everything searching for it. A world within a story whispered to me centuries ago. Of a timeless power, infinite in knowledge, voracious in hunger. The Entity. A realm so close to ours, but always out of reach. Until I found him, Frank Stone. My key, my killer. I am Augustine Lieber, and I'm about to change our worlds forever. Mm. That wasn't ominous. Not ominous at all. Friendly dog, okay. Interesting, baby Brian. I'm calling, assuming it's a dog. Sounds like a dog. Hunt for a missing infant continues, and we just heard a baby crying. Hmm. Oh, police officer. Theater still court. Still plan. Chapter one: The Burning Mall. Theater still, 1963. Sleeping. <laughs> Damn, still mill and tricks. I'm assuming you're the night watchman here. 
I am. Or just you covering the entire site? Oh, no. I got help. Where are they now? On duty? Of a manor. Merlin just goes where he pleases. Merlin, my dog. Dope him and pinch him. Best friend a fella could ask for. Loyal to the seventh horn sounds. Trust him more than I trust myself. Hmm. But do we be serious or do we be concerned? I think we'll be serious. I need to ask you a few questions. I'm yours to dispose of. Can I have your name? Thomas Jefferson Holt. Call me Tom. Officer Sam Green. Tom, I want to talk to you about... I know what about. That missing boy, right? That's right. You think he could be missing here? This mill looks a big place. Biggest in all Cedar Hills. That don't make no difference. Ain't no funny business going on around here. Not undermining Merlin's noses. Hmm, skeptical. A lot of ground, or... Can I check your records? Do the records. You sound, sound confident. confident. And rightly so. Can I Can check, I check your, your records? records? No records. The logbook, visitors to the mill, out of our shifts, that sort of thing. All right, right. Uh... Well, oh, it doesn't be keep Some track place. of them well. Is that it? Uh, it's okay. Sorry. Allow me. I see. So we're going to do accusation, threatening, or disproving. Let's do. Someone's been faking the entries. No. Who? I'm guessing you, Tom. Me? Well, maybe your partner Merlin helps you. Sounds like he's expected to pick up all your slack. It ain't like that. I don't do it for me. I just got to cover for some of the mother fellas now and then. The ones who won't sign in or out. Got any names for me? Well, uh, what is it now? Hank, maybe? Oh, no, no, no. Fred something. Yeah, that's it. Fred, Fred, some. Come on, Tom. I'm sorry, Sam. I don't remember. Alcohol does tend to impair the memory. That what you come out here for? To give a veteran a hard time about his medicinal practices? No. <laughs> I'm here because a child is missing. And every minute wasted is another chance gone to find him. Boy, you ain't gonna find him here. I'd know it in my bones if that boy were within a mile of this mill. Very well. Now let's take a look around. All the same, I'd like to take a look around. You want to do my job for me? Be my guest. Thanks so much. Yeah. Thank you for your help, Tom. Happy well, sir, let's go check out this spooky mill at nighttime. Peter Leak, lure them in. Guaranteed for a lifetime. Hey, we got a flashlight. That's good. Graphics are good in this. I have to say they did a really good job. How do we get in? Oh, looks like the gate's open. Okay. Oh, that's spooky as can be. Can we do this at daytime? There's a big dog in here somewhere. Hey, okay, let's look around. Truck there, that's a nice truck. Another one there. Look what we have here. Is there any place we can get in over here? Like a closed gate. That looks like it's locked. Nothing back there. Workman's hat, okay. 
Well, there's something here. I'll squeeze through here. Let's take a peek. This is going to be a scary game. I can already tell it. the mood is there, that ominous sound. I did turn the copyright music off, so we shouldn't have any copyright issues, but we'll see. Open this up. What's in here? Ooh. Arendessic King. Chess piece. Wonder 12 trinkets found. Sounds like he's looking for the dog. Um, that's it here. Okay. Go back out this way and see if there's another door to go into. So we have secrets to look for. we got to remember that. See if we can find them. We probably won't find them all, but we'll try. Rain? Yep. Well, his lunchbox must be working on it. Okay, I guess that's where we were going. Gonna ask Tom for the key. No running that I can see at the moment. Rats. Oh boy. <sighs> Easy does it. Search for the missing child. Oh, labeling of the boards, nice. That's storage shed number two. Got another squeeze spot. Allows us to load the next area. value of each bundle in this area 147 138 125 boy this is creepy flashlight games always are creepy turn off that so you get the same sense of feel of what I see Best safety manager is a mindful worker. Yes. Well, how about this door? Yeah, you hold the A button. Now we can move it. Make a lot of noise here. Oh, this is ominous. Scary stuff. Alton Melodo, Hazard Present. Go in that door. I'm waiting for something to jump out. Hello? Anyone here? It's police! Blowing up, that's always a scary sign. Who's there? Before I do, I want to make sure 
nothing hidden back here. No. Something's falling down on something over there, it sounds like. Nine o'clock at night. Why are we in this? Dang it. Hey, mister. That's, That's Officer Austin. Green. Sure. You haven't seen Merlin, have you? No. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Uh, you all right there? Uh, yeah, yeah, it's just... It's... Jesus, you don't you smell, smell that? Sniffer's out of commission. <laughs> Got a little too up close and personal with a can of mustard gas back in the trenches. Ah. Uh, it can be a blessing in disguise. Ugh. Gotta find out where it's coming from. What's the smell like? Death. Nothing good. Okay, let's go do this. Do what we see. Oh. Merlin! There you Nasty. are, I wonder where you got to. He's not a good dog. Come here, boy! Dang name it! <laughs> sure to like it if you two made proper acquaintance. God damn it. That don't look good. Yeah, that don't look good at all. You put this out for him? No. It looks like someone else has found his way to your boy's heart. Through his stomach. It ain't possible. Merlin and me, we're a team. Who'd want to come between a man and his best friend? The killer. What's that? Some kind of wiener mate? No. It's a human corpse. Yeah, that's an error. Will you look at that? That damn dog? Think that belongs to the boy you're looking for? Oh, too big for a boy. Yeah. Came from someone much older, a teenager maybe. Jesus, married a milkmaid. Hey, you know about any other folks going missing in Cedar Hills lately? Well, I don't know. Who would know a thing like that? Well, somebody does. And of course, he did all that touching in the bloody stuff, and his hands are not bloody. A napkin was bloody, just put an ear in it. I'm gonna put it in the garbage can. Yeah, nasty. Oh, what do we got here? Oh, where we put the chess piece trinkets? Only gotten one though. What was that sound? Stay behind me. Oh, pulling your weapon there, officer. Sorry. Dog like that and place like this. I'm having the weapon out. So, what is this thing? The great. Yeah, what is it for? It's, uh, for the furnace, I think. You don't know for sure? Yeah, I work at the mill, not in the mill. Hmm. Huh. I find something to pry that gate open with, okay. Take a peek over here. Anything hiding over here? Nothing there. Oh, we can climb up this. Okay, another area to get into. Oh, 
Oh. Gotcha. Pry bar. Good looking pry bar. I'll go back over now. You think he'd have the keys to all the gates so we didn't have to climb over things? Now let's go down into the creepy dark sewer. Stand back. Be a timed event game type of thing. That little cry bar, though, would not be enough to do that. Especially the way he was using it without using the leverage thing. Alright. Take this. Use the radio in my car and call the station. Where, where are you going? You, you really think that boy's down there? I don't know. But I got a feeling, and it's not a good feeling. Hey. I'm gonna need you to take this, too. Make sure the sheriff gets this. Oh, boy, I don't know. I need your help here, Tom. Yes, we do. I wouldn't ask if I didn't. I just don't know if I'm made of the stuff, buddy. They don't call it a higher calling for nothing. You gotta rise to meet it. You can do this. I, I, yeah. I can do this. Come on, hey, vet. You can do it. I'm counting on you, Tom Hope. Does he make it back to the car? That's the big question. Okay, let's get down here. Back up that ladder. Find a way to the furnace chamber. Yeah, this is not good. It wants us to go this way because that's the direction it pointed. But we're going to go back down this way a little bit and look around. We'll go back this way. Furnace access is this way, okay. Furnace access is that way. Huh? Someone is engaged. Okay. I'm gonna go that way. Let's what's this way? That's a dead end. Okay. Let's go down to the furnace room. Okay, let's check this way because I see furnace access this way. This has got to be it. This is not ominous at all. Am 
Oh, it's water dripping. It's like, what is that? Sound like someone was walking with me. Don't turn over your shoulder like that, buddy. Something's going to be right behind me before long. I just know. Uh, this place turns my stomach. Something back here. Um, things just get weirder and weirder down here. Oh, dang, that is weird. I guess the specter leave it down. You don't take it with you. But is that what we're up against? Is the hillbilly down here? Oh, couldn't pay me to do that. Goddamn God small, small spaces. Nope. nope. <sighs> well, I'm not in the police force. Okay, we got that direction, but what's down here before we go that way? That's why we look around. There's a... Interesting. Waiting for something to jump out at us. I really am. Okay, let's go through this passageway. It looks like we're getting closer. Oh, I wasn't Shit. paying attention. Dang it, that hurt. All right, uh -huh. can I do that over again, please? Oh, no, that's bad. Now to do this without a flashlight. Wow. This is hellish. What a heck of a furnace. Son of a fuck. There's the babies. No place for a baby. Uh, what is that? Try the ladder. Now watch out for these timed events. That's not good. Right to aim, trigger attack, so. Sam's brother or something? Come on, get to the crystal. Ah, 
Out. Out. Okay, this is a little gruesome. Ow. Ow. Oh, ouch. Oh. Come on, we can do this. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, get over there. Come on, come on. You can do it. You gotta save the baby. Okay. Oh, that's gruesome. Sleep tight, motherfucker. Yeah. I think that was act one. That was intense. Well, that was interesting. Hope everybody liked it. We're going to pause it there. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. We will, uh, we'll come back in and this will, mark part two on the next video so i hope you enjoyed it give me a like if you enjoyed this first of the halloween episodes and we'll bring you back to the next one uh, on the next episode until then i'll see you on the next one <laughs>